Hi guys, it's Jess, welcome back. I've got a beautiful mindfulness yoga flow for you to try today. This yoga sequence will warm your body up, so it's a great yoga flow to do first thing in the morning. So it's gonna warm all the major muscle groups of the body and it's gonna have a real focus on strengthening, toning and building muscles in your legs, thighs and lower body. I hope you enjoy today's practice. Let's get started. your yoga mat. Hands are together at chest center. Eyes are closed down. Spend a moment reconnecting with your breath. Breathing deeply in and out through your nose. On your next inhale, bring your hands up towards the ceiling. Gentle bend in your back. And as you exhale, folding forward, you can bend your knees here if your hamstrings are tight. Spending a moment here, relax your head and your neck, allowing the muscles of your legs to release, breathing deeply in and out through your nose. When you're ready, take an inhale, stepping back with the right foot and stepping back with the left foot, coming into your high plank. If high plank is too challenging for you today, you may put your knees onto the ground. Otherwise, your knees are up off the ground with me. Take an inhale here. And as you exhale, bend your elbows and slowly lower all the way down onto the ground. Tops of the feet come onto the ground. Inhale, upward facing dog. Extend your arms, relax your shoulders down your back. Breathing deeply here. On your next inhale, Gaze back over your right shoulder, look towards your right foot. Coming back to centre, gazing back over your left shoulder, gazing towards your left foot. Returning to centre, coming up onto all fours, tuck your toes under at the back, downward facing dog. You can pedal the feet out here to release more through the legs. Breathing deeply, relax your shoulders, relax your head and your neck. When you're ready, coming up onto your tiptoes and start to release the heels of your feet down towards the ground. It does not matter if they don't make it all the way down, as long as you're feeling a nice stretch in the back of your legs. Breathe. Take an inhale and begin to walk your feet up towards your hand, coming into your half standing forward fold. Extend your legs. Exhale, folding down into your standing forward fold. You can bend your knees here if your hamstrings are tight. Take a nice deep inhale and come up to standing. Bring your hands up towards the ceiling, allow your palms to touch. Exhale, hands come down through chest center. Well done. We'll repeat this sequence, but we'll move a little bit faster to generate more heat in the body. Inhale, hands come up towards the ceiling, gentle back bend. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, half standing forward fold. As you exhale, stepping back, high plank. Inhale here. Exhale, bend into your elbows, slowly lower all the way down onto the ground. Tops of the feet come onto the ground. Upward facing dog, extend through your arms, relax your shoulders down your back. Tuck your toes under at the back, downward facing dog. You can pedal your feet out here. Take an inhale and then you can step or jump your feet up towards your hands. Half standing forward fold. Exhale, fold down, standing forward fold. Relax your head and your neck, breathe. Inhale, coming up to standing. Exhale, hands come to chest center. Flowing through this sequence just one more time. Inhale, hands come up towards the ceiling. Exhale to fold. Inhale, half standing forward fold. Exhale, gently stepping back, high plank. Being mindful of every movement. On your next exhalation, bend the elbows, keep your elbows in close to your body as you lower all the way down onto the earth. Tops of the feet come onto the ground, extend through the arms. 
relax your shoulders down the back exhale tuck your toes under at the back downward facing dog pedaling your feet walk the legs out relax your head your neck and your shoulders gazing up in between your hands step or lightly jump half standing forward fold exhale fold down standing forward fold inhale to rise hands come up towards the ceiling exhale to bring hands to chest center well done now that the body is nice and warm we'll move into our postures to strengthen the legs take an inhale and bend your right knee bringing it in towards your chest interlace your fingers around the front of your right shin and hug your knee in towards your chest these postures can really challenge your balance if you fall out simply come back in this is a part of the practice beginning to transition into warrior three begin to bring your right leg behind you again if you wobble and fall just simply come back into the pose this is a part of the practice see if you can extend your right leg out behind you transitioning now into a high lunge see if you can slowly lower your back foot down onto the ground bend your left leg coming into a high lunge back heel can come up off the ground here hands are together at chest center take a nice inhale bring your hands up towards the ceiling and extend the front leg exhale bend the front leg hands to chest center let's do two more of these inhale extend the front leg hands come up towards the ceiling exhale bend into your front leg hands come to chest center one more inhale extend the front leg hands come up towards the ceiling exhale bend into the front leg hands return to chest center extend your arms upwards now and lean slightly forward this is a beautiful pose to create strength throughout the lower body and through your core. Coming back to center, start to bring your arms behind you, interlace your fingers and draw your hands backwards. Inhale, bring your hands to chest center. We'll come to a low lunge now. See if you can lower your right knee down onto the ground. Bring the top of that right foot onto the ground. If low lunge feels uncomfortable on your back knee, shuffle your leg around you can move a little forward or a little backwards and see if you can find a comfortable spot you could also grab a cushion or a blanket to place under your knee place your right hand down onto the ground and roll out onto the outer edge of your left foot gently dropping that left knee to the left tuck your right toes under at the back and see if you can catch your right foot with your left hand beautiful quad stretch here breathe deeply Release your right foot slowly back down onto the ground. Left hand comes forward, coming into your half split. Bring your hips back towards your right foot. Extend your left leg. Inhale, returning to your low lunge. Hands are either side of the left foot. Tuck the toes under at the back, stepping back, downward facing dog. Pedal your feet out. Relax your head, relax your neck, returning to the breath. Step or jump your feet up towards your hands, half standing forward fold. Folding down into your standing forward fold on an exhale. Relax your head and your neck. Inhale as you come up to standing. Exhale to bring the hands down to chest center. Let's repeat this sequence on the other side now. Inhale as you bend your left leg and bring it in towards your chest. Interlace your fingers around your left shin and draw your knee in towards your chest. Taking nice deep breaths here. Bringing the hands to chest center. Let's transition to warrior three. Seeing if we can bring that left leg out behind us. I always wobble and fall in this pose. If you wobble and fall, just simply return to the posture again. Breathing deeply here. slowly transitioning to our high lunge see if you can bring that left foot down onto the ground behind you
as you come into your high lunge on this side, bending into your front right leg. That left heel can come up off the ground here. Exhale here. Inhale, bring your hands up towards the ceiling, extend your front leg. Exhale, hands to chest center, bending into your knee. Let's do two more of these. Inhale, hands come up towards the ceiling, extend your front leg. Exhale, hands to chest center, front knee bends. Inhale, hands come up, extend your front leg. Exhale, bending your leg, hands to chest center. Well done. Extend your arms out in front. Breathe deeply here. Feel the strength and support in your legs. Inhale as you come back to center, hands come behind the back, interlace the fingers, draw the hands back, feel that beautiful stretch through the chest, opening up through the heart, stretching the shoulders. Well done, hands come to chest center, slowly lower that back knee down, low lunge, top of the foot comes onto the earth. Coming into our twist on this side. Left hand comes down onto the ground. Rolling out onto the outer edge of your right foot. Drop that right knee gently towards the ground. Feel that incredible stretch through the legs. Tuck the left toes under at the back. See if you can reach around with your right hand and grab your left foot. This can be a challenging stretch. If you're feeling any cramping or if it's too difficult, simply skip this step. Breathing deeply in and out through your nose. Release the foot back down to the earth, half splits. Draw your hips back towards your left heel. Right leg is extended. Feel that beautiful stretch, breathing deeply. Coming back to your low lunge. Tuck the toes under at the back, stepping back, downward facing dog. Walk the feet out, relax the head, relax the neck. Return to the breath, breathing deeply. Next, we're going to come into some postures that will deeply strengthen your legs and your back. Come into your high plank pose. On your next exhalation, Bend your elbows, keep your arms in close to your body, slowly lower down onto the ground. Tops of the feet and the forearms come onto the ground, coming into your Sphinx Pose. Take an inhale here, and as you exhale, place one hand on top of the other in front of you and rest your forehead down onto your hands. Inhale and lift your right leg up off the ground, using the muscles in your back to bring this leg up. Exhale to bring the leg down. Inhale to lift the left leg. Exhale, release it down. This time, extend your left arm out in front of you. Inhale, lift your right leg and your left arm. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift your left leg and your right arm. Exhale to release. Inhale, lift both legs and both arms up off the ground. Exhale to release. Interlace your fingers behind your back. Extend your arms back. Inhale and lift both legs up off the earth. Breathe. Exhale. Release your head back down onto your hands. Rest your head on your hands and we'll come into crocodile pose. Simply point your toes towards the outsides of your mat, giving you an unusual and beautiful stretch down through your ankles and your legs. Spend a moment here reconnecting with your breath, feeling your breath, feeling the rise and fall of your back as you breathe, consciously relaxing the muscles of your face, relaxing your arms and your shoulders. Let your back and your legs relax, consciously relaxing through your feet, through your ankles and through your toes.
Relax your entire body. When you're ready, you can just come to sit in the middle of your mat. Bring your hands to your chest center and close your eyes down. Spend a moment thanking yourself for taking the time out of your day to reconnect with your mind and your body. Namaste.